beautiful. But can't you see? It's all beautiful. All of it. All the pale light twinkling off leaves and eyes and rivers of concrete twinkling as he stands before you or she stands before you or the great it of nothing stands before you. All pale light twinkling, raining its body down on the stuff of things, on the matter and absence of things, where it swirls and twines, where it catches and bursts up again. All blue and red and golden apostrophes, where it silences briefly on bits of dust and sprinkle, where it silences then dances up again, away and toward, away and through, away and bounce and spin and back again. Beautiful. And the pain, all that pain and grief and sickness and tragedy of darkness, of body, of desperate soul, all that lostness, all that sad and unfortunate shit of bones, that's all beautiful too. That's all beautiful too. As it carries us through, as it shudders and trembles us down to element, down to single thing, as it opens hands and veins and black eyes blinking against veil and fog, opens to the differentiation of contrast, to the intricacies of water or dirt or pink lines and palm, as we wind ourselves down, down to silence, down to white of sun, down to pale and simple. The first whale, the first number, the first brown reed, its steady breath and sway. Beautiful. Listen, I know. I'm not the one you would expect to be saying these things, all noosed up the way I've been, all bound the way I've been for these innumerable fragments of a lifetime. And I'm not making any claims. I know you know this shit already, but still it's there, still you can see it, still you know it's beautiful, it is, it's beautiful, and right here, right now, right in this infinite, this infinitesimal space of light, I just thought, I don't know, maybe, maybe for the moment, maybe for some small reason, maybe for just now, maybe it just might be worth mentioning.